Hey guys, welcome back to Struggleville YouTube channel. For this video, I have 94 new Harbor Freight coupons to share with you. These go through the middle of December. We'll take a browse through them and see which ones are the best in the bunch. Also, before we get to that, I got some bonies for you. Everyone loves the bonies. They want all the bonies and nothing but the bonies. So everything's going to be linked down below. And before we get to that coupon, or those 94 coupons, we're going to shoot over to this page right here. We have the Irwin Vice Grip C-Clamp Locking c-clamp six inch it is currently on sale for 875 free shipping of course for the prime members out there tool nut sells the same item for 13.99 plus shipping so more than twice the price of tool nut 875 right now right now on amazon next up we have the skill power core brushless 12 volt ratchet wrench kit comes with a two amp hour battery Amazon has it for $69. Over at Lowe's, it is $114. At Acme, it is $129. And then at Walmart, we're price matching, vice versa, at $69 and free shipping from them as well. And I even put in a video I did on this item at least a year ago, very long time ago. Overall, I really liked this ratchet. When I first picked it up, I had also already had purchased the Skill 12-volt 5-tool combo kit. So I already had a couple of batteries and a charger to pair nicely with it. And it was really nice to have that 5-tool kit and this all in the garage, just like garage tools. Um, but keep in mind, Amazon also has the Denali brand. And we've had a ton of really cheap deals. If you go to Amazon and look up Denali, they have a bunch of cordless tools that are really cheap. And they're all compatible with the skill stuff. The tools, the batteries, the chargers. They are completely interchangeable. So when you put those two lineups together, there's a ton of tools that you can get really cheap. And I don't think you can find another cordless ratchet from a major brand for $69 for the whole kit. If, if you find it, email it to me. We'll post it. Next up, we got the Battery Daddy. 180 battery organizer with storage case and the tester. It's on sale just for $9.99 right now. This is another item I picked up a couple of years ago. For $9.99, I think it's actually a really good deal. Both ends actually open up and have different types of storage. You get the little tester right in the middle so you know if the batteries are dead or not. And it just holds like... A shit ton of batteries or 180 which is equal reusable respirator mask with filters gas mask with anti-fog safety goggles half face respirator mask and this guy is on sale no coupon or promo code needed just a sale price of $9.99 normally $22 so a really good deal and those filters and everything are obviously interchangeable they're universal so you can change them out with another brand you don't have to stick with this one but $9.99 for that and the goggles. Really good there. And then we have a precision screwdriver set. 120 in 1 electronics magnetic repair kit by Yin San. Comes in the handy dandy case. Even has a little magnetizer there. You got the little suction cup guy for pulling the screen off your phone. Some plastic pry tools and a little guitar pick priors. And they are $19.99 is the original price. But then there's a Prime member discount, which brings it down to $15 or so. And then we have a 35% promo code that's currently active. So if you're a Prime member, after the promo code, you're going to pay about $10, which is a really good deal for that set. Nice and compact. And uh, depending on what kind of projects you do, it could be incredibly useful for you. Now let's shoot back over to the coupons and see what we can find. You know, the one problem with these coupons is it's coming right after Black Friday and Cyber Monday. And for the most part, they gave us our best prices for that sale. So we can't have too high hopes here. I'm really hoping they do a little uptick in both free items and the specialty coupons where it's, you know, 30% off items under $10. Or if you're an Inside Track Club member, it's under $20, the 30% coupon. there. They have some other kind of unique coupons that aren't just a specific product at a specific price. And I feel like this is a good time to start rolling out a few of those. Usually they're only good for the weekend. And of course, if they do come out with those, they'll be posted this page right here, the Harbor Freight Coupons page on my website. Link down below with all of the others. Um, but this is the same page I update every time, so you can always have the latest coupons. Right in the middle there, you have the 30-inch four-drawer tech card. It's $169.99. That's $20 more than what I paid for the five-drawer. I know it was a couple of years now, but boy, it's just hard to look at those prices and be like, oh yeah, guys, go get that. You know, it's, 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 it's a tough one. Now, right below it, we have for $220, the 900-pound capacity scaffold. 
And a couple of weeks ago, we posted a Home Depot deal that had a similar scaffold deal that was $159, and that might still be available. Um, I guess you can go to Home Depot's website and type in scaffold, see if you find one for $159, or I'm sure it's on my website under the Home Depot uh, category pages. But the point is, it was much cheaper in just a couple of weeks ago. So again, uh, a bit high on the price for my liking. I kind of like the pressure washer over here. I don't know if I'd, I like 220, but I do like the pressure washer itself. I told myself a long time ago, whenever I upgrade my pressure washers, I'm always getting one with wheels because I am not carrying all that crap everywhere. And then it's got the little solution tank in the front, which is a nice little added benefit. It has a little bit of cord management, but it's kind of boo-boo cord management because it looks nice in the picture, but you'll never get it wrapped up like that again. So eh, it's okay. Uh, we got the charger right there in the middle at $59.99, a little bit higher than what it used to be. Um, but pretty useful. We get charger deals pretty regularly as far as Amazon promo codes that will get posted on the website, so I'm not terribly concerned about it. Not a bad price on the 100-watt solar panel at $89.99. Generally, when I'm looking at them, we want to stay at a dollar a watt or less. Now, usually I'm looking at the folding ones that are more portable, not any type of permanent installation, so people can take them on the go with them. And those, are, of course, are more expensive than these flat panel ones, but it's not bad. Uh, the stool used to be $19.99 all the time, so we're $5 more. Um, I bought the old version, I believe the recalled one, and it broke, and then I had to weld it back together, and then it broke again, and now I just sit on the floor, basically, because it doesn't work. Uh, let's see, a couple of tarps here. I kind of like this deal on the Icon 800 Lumen Rechargeable Magnetic Handheld Foldable Slim Bar Work Light. It's $24.99, says normally $40. I would like to know... If it's an 18650 or 21700, I'm sure someone out there knows, or it's probably in the listing on the page that I'm not going to pull up. But uh, I do kind of wonder about that. And I would like to compare it with some of the other ones that I've picked up. If you've been a long time subscriber to the channel or visitor of my website, maybe I don't know, several months ago, we had two packs of similar lights that were plastic, and this looks like it's probably metal, that were very cheap. They're only a couple of dollars each. Similar size, I'm guessing similar lumen rating. If I ever felt like pissing away $25 on a product I didn't need, I might buy this and do a little comparison video on the two. But I would like to see, okay, they're charging $25. I got ones in the single digit dollar mark. Uh, is it much better or not? $99.99 for the tripod lights. It's detachable, I guess, is good, but it is a plug-in. At $100, we're getting pretty close to finding a deal on the Milwaukee tripod or the DeWalt tripod. Used to get free item coupons for the now 99 cent microfiber cleaning cloths. I have this ratchet over here. I think I paid $9.99 for it. And it's like a good shit ratchet. Does that make sense? It's good and it's shit. Like, if you feel the mechanism on this thing, I think it has four teeth in there. It's four, I think. Maybe five. Okay, but you gotta turn this thing around almost in a complete circle before it grabs the next tooth, and it feels clunky. But, I like that this little collar pulls back, and you can shorten the handle or lengthen the handle. Don't you wish you could do that? And then, it... it it gives you more leverage, obviously, when it's longer, and it's a ratchet that you can lean on, and I haven't broke it yet, and if I do break it, I don't care, because I didn't pay much for it, you know? There's some ratchets where I might just have a little tear to my eye if I broke it, because that thing was expensive. <laughs> this one ain't that, so. so that's what I mean. It's good, but it's also shit. <laughs> the Braun 140 Lumen Rechargeable Pen Light, we're moving over here. $14.99, I mean, I like it better at $10. I can't believe it was originally $20. That just sounds really high for a pen light. $59.99 for the Braun Under Hood Work Light. We just posted the DeWalt one as a bear tool, and over Black Friday, Cyber Monday, it was $114.00. That one works on both the 20-volt and the 12-volt DeWalt batteries. It folds in half. It's got the same little hook guys on the ends. You can light up just half of it or the whole thing. That's what I personally have, and I really like that light. I really like it. I think I saw the next day it went up to 190 so that 114 price was really good. So this one is rechargeable. It's half of that price. doesn't look like it folds, which may not be a big deal for you. In addition to using it under a hood or putting it on a hood to shine down on your engine compartment, they're really great underneath the car and shining up to illuminate that way. 
I bet even if you were doing something in the trunk, maybe depending on your vehicle, changing out the fuel sending unit or something, you can probably put this on a trunk lid and get some good light down that way, even just changing taillights or something maybe. Uh, so fifty nine ninety nine. okay, I'll take it, you know, that's not bad. Uh, you got the 18-inch machete. I mean, Halloween next year, you can make your Michael Myers costume a little more authentic, you know? Four ninety nine for the reciprocating saw blades. It's a pretty good price. I don't remember if I've ever used their reciprocating saw blades, so I don't know if they're any good. Everyone should have a little pry tools like this, and at four ninety nine, hard to go wrong with that. Anytime you're taking part interior stuff or plastic stuff on your car, which is basically the entire car these days, it's nice to use the plastic panel so you don't scratch and gouge things up. I love these little cutter guys. I don't have this one specifically, but I have a skill one that looks like the identical design, at least as far as the head of it right here. And back in the day when eBay was my primary source of income, and then later Amazon selling, uh, I would cutting up boxes all day, every day. And this is so much easier than a razor knife or scissors or anything. This thing just is like butter. And so it saved me tons of time and got daily use for a very long time. Now, the skill one, I think, has been discontinued. I don't think you can buy it anymore. But uh, this style of tool, anyway, big fan of. Little tire, tire repair kits are nice to keep handy. Especially after you get the case and all the spots, you know, for it. You can just then go to, like, a local store or whatever and buy just the, the plug guys, whatever they call these things. And just replenish them if you were to use them. I mean, that's a lot of flat tires, though. And as far as I know, they don't dry out. I have ones that were years old and still gooey as shit. But what I really like about it is the T-handle because the cheap little kits that you get at like Home Depot or Menards or something, they got that plastic like screwdriver handle and it's just not comfortable in your hand at all. Especially if you got one like it's like a little hole and you got to kind of open that thing up a little bit. The T-handles are just nice. This would be fun. I want to use this on my driveway. All the snow and ice gone. Be a good way to start your bonfire, too. Let's see. One day I'm going to do some belt sander races. If you haven't seen those, check that out. Belt sander racing looks awesome. $4.99 on the 10-pack of cutoff wheels. That's $0.50 cents a piece. Kind of like that. This looks just like the Vavor hydraulic table that they sent me maybe six months ago. Ever since they sent me that, I've been using the hell out of it because... I, tried, I switched it up that time when I was on purpose halfway through the sentence. I was like, you know what? I'm not going to say it again. I'm going to change it. $219.99 on this one. But I've been using it a ton, and it looks like the same design other than mine being yellow. Boy, it is really nice. Because I don't like squatting down and picking up heavy stuff anymore or bending over and picking up heavy stuff. I'm getting too old for that. Just lift it up to waist high for me, will you? Just get get me that far, okay? I can carry it the rest of the way. Uh, $59.99 on the 50-foot retractable hose reel. Mine's by Tecton, but looks similar. Really like the retractable hose reels. Get them off the floor, although air compressors are somewhat obsolete these days. Somewhat. 15 bucks for some bungee cords. No, thank you. You can keep those. $39.99 on the manual charger with engine start. I kind of like that. I'm thinking by the word manual, they mean dumb, as in the opposite of the smart ones. Smart ones are cool and everything, but if your battery's dead dead, like 0.0, .0 volts, that smart one ain't going to help you. It relies on the battery having some voltage so that the reverse polarity thing works. When your battery's dead as the doornail, your smart charger's screwing you. So having something like this can be helpful. Or get yourself an 18-volt battery or something and just... Juice it for a second, I guess. One ton shop crane, two thirty nine ninety nine. Someone's gonna say, "Don't do that." That's not safe. Don't do that. You'll blow up the battery. Don't whisper. Start calling you Biden. That's creepy. Okay, now, I always get excited when I see this, and it's short lived, because it looks like it's a kit with a battery included. Because the picture looks like it. Because it's included. But if you read it, if you read says tool only says it's high torque maybe 109.99 not a bad price no matter what for an impact uh, impact wrench 
but I wanted the battery to go with it. So it's a letdown. It's like I would have felt good about it if it didn't show the battery, but I already saw the battery with that price, and then I saw tool only, so by then you already blew it for me. I'm already pissed that I'm not getting the battery. A little folding chair used to be $19.99 for like a decade, and now it's $27, $28. So many times I saw it, and it was nineteen. It was always nineteen. I say, you know what? If they bring that, if that ever hits like fourteen ninety nine, sixteen ninety nine, I'm in for two. I'm in for two. Never happened. Now it's up. Now I can never buy it because I know what I could have had it at. All right, guys. That wraps it up for this video. We got some more amazing deals getting posted on the website, so make sure to check it out. Subscribe for an Irish subscriber. Make sure I give the video a like. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.